clerk is gunned down at a convenience store in Cecil County and tonight only on WMER 2 News. We learned for the first time what happened at night and police say who pulled the trigger. WMER 2 News Jeff Hager has a story you'll see only on WMER 2 News. The shooting happened just before five o'clock in the morning back on November 30th and almost two months after the death of 7-Eleven clerk Brenda Duncan, police are revealing what happened, and they're unmasking the man seen in these surveillance photos, identifying him as 22-year-old Sharif McCormick of Wilmington, Delaware. Goes in there like he's gonna buy some things. When he gets to the counter and our victim, um, Ms. Duncan walks up to check him out. He produces a handgun. She gets scared, proceeds to run to the back of the store to escape, and he essentially executes her because he didn't like the way she responded. Police later learned that McCormick had walked to this 7-Eleven from his mother's home where he was staying just seven blocks from here. Police found clothing like that seen in the store's cameras and the gun used in the killing at that location. But McCormick was gone. They would soon discover that on the same day he allegedly gunned down Duncan, someone shot him in Delaware.